Hi guys, Joe at Toho Marine and Outdoors here in St. Cloud. Want to show you a new model today? This is the new 189 Velo Stratus. It's uh, quite a big change from their standard 285 that was one of our best sellers for the last 10 years. We'll take a look at the front of the boat and we'll move to the back. Up front, we've got it powered with a new coat of Fortrex. And one of the things that I really find unique on this boat is you often, with your electronics sitting right here in the middle of the front of the foot pedal, all your wires from your trolling motor seem to hide your electronics. So they made it extra wide right over here where you can install electronics on the side and have great visibility. This is a brand new model for Stratus. It's 18 foot 9, weighs approximately 1,500 pounds, has about 33 gallons of fuel capacity. It is a great fishing and running platform. As you'll notice, when we get back to the console, a very aerodynamic console. And if you look at the dash, there's no vinyl. Uh, this boat is really industrial looking. This is hard plastic. You can read your gauges fabulously. Even down to the interior, you have snap-in, snap-out carpet and a textured floor. Very unique to this boat. Uh, it's got some great features. Here's, here's a unique feature that I haven't seen on any boat. This is the first boat on the planet that has this. As industrial looking as it is, it's a very wide platform, a very stable platform, and it runs fabulously. But one of the bonuses to this, smaller boats are hard to put dual consoles in. Well, Stratus took care of that. This is a flip-up windshield, and we've had this boat out at speed, and that windshield will stay up. It'll keep the rain off you, the bugs off you, sometimes the ducks on Toho. It'll keep those off you. It's a pretty awesome, new, innovative kind of way to not be all cramped with another side console on this side of the boat. Pretty unique deal for Stratus. I'm going to crawl up in the boat. We'll look at some of the storage. As you can see here, you've got a nice step up. Center rod locker and storage. You can put all your tackle trays right in the bottom. You've got room to store six rods. Also got your fish measuring rule right where it needs to be. A place for your scissors and your pliers. Another rod storage box. got a little day box. You can use this as a cooler or just a day box for your tackle. And another great storage box here. A lot of storage for an 18 foot 9 inch boat. We're also going to take this boat out on the lake today and run it around a little bit. One awesome platform in rough water especially for its size. At 18 foot 9, uh, as big a guy as I am, it's a very comfortable boat to fish off of and it, the seating is fabulous. As you can see, there's plenty of room behind the wheel. You can view your electronics easy. Everything's where it should be. We're going to have her out there. We've got this, this boat powered with a 150 Pro XS. That's the max motor on this boat. This boat will actually do mid, mid 60s. Fabulous fishing platform. We're going to take it to the lake and go have some fun. <laughs> 